<laughs> what is going on everybody? And hyvää vappua! It's the 1st of May, or May Day. Actually, it's tomorrow. It's a national holiday in Finland and we celebrate it basically for two days. And this is the first one. Usually it's kind of like the beginning of summer, but... Well... It's not very summery at the moment. So, we're going to the city center and see what is going on there. There's Pokemon shirt! Yay! I need this in my life. <laughs> because the weather is bad and we don't really want to be outside and in the city. We just decided to go to the supermarket, get some <laughs> groceries and we're gonna go spend the rest of the day one at home and play some video games. We so spend the rest of the day in high room. Yeah. Alright, see you there. So we got back home and now I would like to tell you what the traditional foods for Vappu are in Finland and Inku is gonna help me with that. First of all we have Kuttipannu and I picked the vegetarian one which instead of meat has corn and Kuttipannu comes from Sweden and literally means tiny little pieces on a pan and basically it's just sausage and potato cubes and it's pretty good actually and bye bye then we have tippaleipä and then sima which is traditional meat people usually make it themselves I have made it many times myself as well and I really love it and with sima we eat munkki which is really delicious but I don't have it here at the moment I might have it tomorrow yeah, I didn't remember to mention, but I've never tried this, so let's try it out. But I actually love puttipan, so let's hope this is good. It's different, but it's actually really good. It's more spicy than normal puttipan, but I like it. Okay, so that's what we eat in Vappu. I just killed the last boss of Dark Souls DLC, uh, The Ringed City. So, cheers to that! Hello everybody, it's Vappu day 2. Last night we didn't do anything special, just played video games, we played Zelda, Breath of the Wild, and I played Dark Souls 3, and finally killed the asshole boss in the end. Finally! Cheers to that! So now, you probably noticed that the weather is actually quite nice. It's warm, it's sunny, can't complain, it's a bit windy though. But anyway, we're going to the center again to show you what Vappu really looks like. And after that, we're gonna go to check out our friend's new home or apartment. All right, let us go. I almost stepped on a poop. God, the bus took so long. There's so much traffic. It, it took like two times the time it usually takes to get to the center. But we are here and we're gonna check out the market here. Or marketplace, whatever it is. And by the way, you probably have noticed that people wear those white hats today. That Yerina also wore yesterday. I also have one at home, but it's the most uncomfortable hat I own, so I refuse to wear it. It's basically a hat you get when you graduate from high school, and people wear it only on Bapu. Or in Bapu. So it's kind of like a traditional hat. As you may be able to tell, it's freaking busy day. And I think it's the busiest day in the whole year in Tampere. And it's you also the sunniest day! <laughs> you never see this many people on the streets on any other day. So let's go look a bit closer. Bapu is also super fun even for kids because they sell lots of prank stuff, toys, candy, balloons. I used to love Bapu as a child as well. And people throw trash away. Oh, 
unicorn in one piece. Yes, please. Oh my god. I Get me one of those. <laughs> of course, Bappu wouldn't be Bappu without Sima and Munke. And the thing is, with Munke, there's a challenge. You gotta eat it without licking your lips. And I'm gonna do it for you, even though it's gonna ruin my beard, most likely. But let's try it out. I'm covered in sugar now. Was it worth it? Yeah. Cool. Okay, let's go. Cool, cool. Same beer as yesterday. A bit more people. Look, that's called teekari kaste or teekari dipping. They dip freshmen of one university in Tampere to the river. I think it's some kind of freshman ritual or something. Look how many people there are. So many. I'm sure you have noticed those colorful overalls people are wearing. Those are all students, and I do have one, but I don't like to wear that either. I'm such a boring, awful person. In one year, there's three important days for drinking in Finland. One of them is Midsummer, one of them is New Year, and Bappu is the last one. And seriously, people drink a lot in Bappu. Oh, and Sorry if my hand is shaking, I have like 5 kilos of liquids hanging from it. But yeah, this is basically the central main road of Tampere. And they close it for a day during Vappo so people can roam around it. And now you can actually see a lot of people. Alright, now we are going to Jarmos place in Härmälä. Or, what is the sound of accent? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, now we are going to our friend's place. And that's it. We got back to the center from our friend Jarmo. Thank you for having us, it was fun. We were playing Switch and PlayStation and having some good time with friends. And now the center is surprisingly quiet and completely covered in trash. Like me. Like Yerina. Yep, somebody's gonna have to clean it up. But yeah, now we're going home to play a bit more and sleep and eat and so on. And yeah, this was the Finnish Vappu and I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, leave a like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye!